Hello you guys and welcome back to my channel. Where do you think we are today? You already know by the title, we're at Costco. We're doing a big old Costco haul today. I've got both the babies with me. Logan's right there and Isla's right behind me. Um, and we're gonna go ahead and head in. I have a little bit of a list, but I really wanna try and highlight the frozen section for you guys today. So leave me an emoji down below. Let's do the elephant emoji if you guys like Costco hauls. All right, let's head in. Can you show it to her? Good job. Good job, buddy. Sales, guys, we got some sales here. So the very first thing that I came across were these Pantene uh, shampoo and conditioners. They're sold separately. They are both in the scent rosemary and lemon, um, but they're also both $7.99, which makes them $3 off. They're typically $10.99. I don't know how much cheaper you can get for shampoo. As a hairstylist, this is not something I would recommend just because it really coats your hair with a lot of wax. Um, which does make it feel softer temporarily, but then eventually breaks it off in the end. Um, but if you still like Pantene, $7.99 is a great deal for it, and this goes on until September 26th. Also on sale are these Venus Comfort Glide razors. These are the ones that we like to use. I actually bought the blue refill last time, and they are not as good as these ones. These are the white tea ones. They have three blades, blah, blah, blah. You also get like the handle with it too, with 12 of those blades in there, and they're $10 off. That's a great deal way, way cheaper than you can get it in like Target. Um, but what is this? Spend $100, get $25 back with P&G products. So I don't know, that goes until the 26th though. And these guys are $20. Apparently all of the like beauty stuff is on sale <laughs> for this next month. But this guy, the Crest White Strips are $32.99. I used to love using these, except they hurt my teeth so bad. But I've I feel like nothing gets them whiter. I still have yet to try the one that keeps going around called Luminu. Um, but anyways, these come with uh, 20 treatments. Wow, that's a lot. 20 treatments and then four treatments of the One Hour Express. They're great. Anyways, $32.99. I'm understanding now. Um, these are all a part of this buy $100, get $25 back with the P&G stuff. That's why they're all on sale but they also have our favorite toothbrushes right here. These are super easy and a great thing to have on hand if you have guests over and they forget their toothbrush or something like that. It's always good to have extra toothbrushes if you guys get sick. I know you guys said that you can clean them with hydrogen peroxide and I'm like, I would just rather not risk it. I would much rather just get a new toothbrush after I'm sick than try and clean it. Anyways, $10 for eight of these. You could probably hear Logie Bear in the background asking for a snack. You want a snack? Okay, he's gonna have these little Annie's fruit gummy bunnies. You can get these at Target or Thrive. They're even cheaper on Thrive, but the cheapest place I've seen them is Sam's Club. Another thing that's on sale are these Cascade Platinum little like dishwasher packs. They're the little pods that you throw in there. And my mother-in-law was asking for more of these. So we're gonna grab her a pack and they are on sale this week, which is awesome. $15, you get 92 of them. They're also part of that P&G, spend $100, get $25 back. But you can either get this one. I was looking for this one, but I can't seem to find it. So looks like it's all the same thing though. While I'm grabbing this stuff, I'm also nursing sis right now in the carrier. A ton of you guys have asked me how I do this. I'm telling you, it's a lifesaver. The fact that I can go in and shop or cook or do whatever while nursing her saves a lot of time. So I have a highlight on my Instagram called nursing carrier and it's all about how to nurse in your carrier. It's actually really simple, but it does kind of take like a minute to get used to it. So don't give up on it if it's hard the first time. Love this couch. I love the tufting. I don't know, I think that's really cute. It's pretty big. I'd say it could probably fit mm, six people maybe like five more comfortably, but it does come with this big ottoman and like the chase lounge. I love that. So you get this Thomasville sectional. It's three pieces for what? Just under $1,100. Washers and dryers. Uh, not something I ever thought I'd be talking about, but when you become an adult, this is the exciting stuff. Um, I personally would go with a top loader just cause then you don't have to worry about like the mildew and the mold with the front loaders. And I feel like my stuff gets cleaner with the top loader. I don't know, but the top loader washer in white, which I believe is this one is $500. I have definitely shared these with you guys before because they are my favorite. We have this Snapware 18 piece uh, glass set for Tupperware and I love it because everything fits inside of each other and that way my Tupperware like cabinet is not a mess ever. 
and it all matches. It's all the same. I always have the right amount of lids. Um, so for 25 bucks, I would get rid of all of your Tupperware and just start over with a new set. I love the glass one, but they also have the plastic one right here. It is BPA free, which is great. Um, and this one is a little bit cheaper at $20, but personally, um, I just love the glass set because it doesn't absorb any, like if you were to microwave spaghetti in it, it doesn't absorb that color. So a couple of options here, but they also have this LO 10 piece glass meal food prep set too. I've seen these guys around, especially at like TG Maxx and Home Goods and stuff and Target, I will say, but you get 10, so five containers, five lids for $25, but it is going away. So if you're wondering how I film and do Costco all by myself with two kids, it is snacks. And he's about to run through the last pack of gummies. This is the third pack, but it's kind of a free for all with snacks whenever I do these Costco hauls. So I'm gonna go ahead and open this third pack. Um, oh my gosh, so much good stuff here though, you guys. Look at this one. The pop ones, the pop containers, I love these. I think they're so fun. The only thing I did hear the other day is, oh, well, someone said they weren't BPA free, but this right here says, no BPA, so I don't know. Anyways, nine pieces, and you get it for $47.99 right now. Um, ooh, this may not be on sale by the time you guys see this, but 60 bucks for nine of them. I asked you guys over on my Instagram about kids' winter coats, because I feel like you can spend $100 on them and then they grow right out of them. And I don't like spending $100 on coats, even for myself. So they do have some winter coats out right now. I bet you they'll be coming out with even more as the season goes on. But right now they're 20 bucks, so um, thank you to whoever told me to look here. I can't remember who it was um, in my DMs, but they've got Spider-Man, like Marvel characters. I think these are Marvel. And then some cute little princess ones over there. First thing we are stopping for is some bananas. I love to put these in my berry freezes, but if you have bananas that are starting to go bad and don't wanna use them for like banana bread, which is the obvious, go ahead and cut them up and put them in your freezer for smoothies. And that's what we do with them. So we're gonna grab whatever looks best, organic or non-organic, because bananas you don't necessarily have to buy organic. I'd probably get, mm, I'd say two, yeah. Let's grab two of them, huh? gonna pick up a bag of these little potato company creamer potatoes we've been doing these the past couple weeks and have loved them I wish they were organic but taking what I can get with the options here they are $7.99 for five pounds he's got our list there do you want strawberries okay. you want corn okay we can grab some corn before I do that let's grab some strawberries right here organic strawberries two pounds for $7.49 I'm just gonna try and see if there are ones that aren't completely mushy yet. I also love putting strawberries in my berry freeze as like one of the toppings too. This one looks good. Do you want blackberries? No. You want them? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> we're going to grab some blackberries. Ooh, three fifty nine. That's not bad. Wish they were organic, but that's okay. Take our options while we can get them. I think this one looks good. We're going to grab some broccoli florets as well as some cauliflower florets right here. Cauliflower is $4.99. Broccoli is $6.99. Ooh, and it's organic this time. And then we're also gonna go for some organic Brussels sprouts too. I love putting these guys into the um, oven at 425 with like some oil and some seasonings on them and cook them for about 15, 20 minutes and they're amazing. Cool. It's cold in there. Yeah, I agree. Um, I found these, these are so fun. I've never seen them before. Mini all American cakes with fudge icing. There's a six pack of them. So just a little bit bigger than a cupcake, but still perfect for a party. For $7.99, that's a great price. So last time in my comments, one of you guys told me to ask the back of Costco for a 10 pound pack of ground beef and that it would be cheaper per pound. And I just asked them and they said that that's not a thing. So we're just gonna grab this big old guy right here, which is somewhere around like seven pounds, most of them, seven or eight pounds. Usually if it were my house, I would grab the organic ground beef, but it's not my house. So we are going to grab just the regular ground beef. And then when we get home, grandpa usually splits it into like three portions and then we freeze the rest. You guys might remember last time we bought these Amy Lou Andouille chicken sausages. Well, and now they're on sale for $4 off. We still have plenty that we don't need any of these. They are a little bit spicier than I remembered getting at like the little trial stand, which is why we bought them in the original place because I had a sample of them and they were good. Um, but they are still very, very good. I do not need any chicken sausage this week, but if I did, I'd be going for this Sabatino's organic basil and cracked black pepper one. Great ingredients on the back. Um, $13.89 for that guy. Ooh, this is interesting. They have tandoori recipe chicken thighs. They're boneless and skinless. Um, that's awesome. It's by the meat district. I don't know if you guys remember, but at my Costco, the meat district carries these like sirloin burgers and they are so good. So if that is any kind of like 
indication of how good these would be, I would definitely go for these. This looks fabulous and in a totally different place than I would ever expect it to be. Um, it's in like one of the cases like where they have the little tiramisu cups and the salami and all that, but it is an apple crumb cheesecake. It's by the brand Juniors. Tell me that doesn't look so dang good. $15.99 for that one. This is something new that I have not seen before. This is Zach's Tavern Oktoberfest Buttered Spatzel. I have no idea what that means. No idea what it is, but $7.89 for that guy. And they have some new Kevin's Foods options out here. I told you guys before I love these guys because they are pretty allergy friendly. Some of them are even like no dairy and all of that kind of stuff, which is so nice. They really are ready in five minutes. They're super easy. You would just pair it with your favorite rice or whatever. This one is Thai curry, curry cauliflower and it's $8.99. I believe you get two packages in there, but I could be wrong. And then this one is the paleo roasted garlic chicken, which sounds fabulous to me. You could easily serve that over some pasta um, for $12.99. You want to try it? This is the Stone Fire Naan and the Spinach Artichoke Parmesan Dip. No. Great job, babe. You want to try some? No. Okay. And our dip, I've been waiting to come back to get this. I honestly might grab two because it was so stinking good and I put it on everything. It's this Good Foods Buffalo style dip. It is plant-based. There's no dairy in it. There's no gluten in it. There are nuts in it though. So if you're allergic to nuts, definitely stay away, but it is so good. I think it's like around $6.99 or something like that. He is loving the naan bread so much. The lady gave us extra, which was so sweet of her, but we're over here getting our almond flour tortillas that we love. $11.79 for those guys. Trying to decide if I want to buy one or two though. It comes with 20 tortillas. It's just way cheaper here than you can get in the store. If you guys have allergies, this is a great brand for you, especially if you have an allergy to corn. For a snack this week, we're gonna grab some of the Angie's Boom Chicka Pop. It's not like the greatest snack for you, but we've been kind of fudging on things a little bit while we're at grandma's because what else do you do at grandma's but eat, you know, cookies and stuff. $5.69 for that guy. Um, these are the only ingredients in there. I would love if it was organic corn, but it's non-GMO project verified, which is great. Is it hot? <laughs> we're trying some of these little sausage links that they had out today. Um, oh my gosh, what? They have gluten-free chicken nuggets here? <gasps> I have never seen that before. I'll have to check the ingredients on that. They also have these Just Bear um, lightly breaded chicken breast chunks, so basically nuggets. For $14.49 you get um, four pounds of them. The gluten-free ones are by the brand Golden Platter. I've never heard of that before. Um, about three and a half pounds for 13 bucks. That would be a great deal. I gotta check these out. I talked to you guys about these in my Sam's Club haul and I told you that I found them at Costco as well. They're the organic acai bowls, but there's six of them in here versus four of them at Sam's Club. Um, so I would definitely rather get them here, but they are fabulous. They are so, so good, especially if you are on the go. Um, they're just acai bowls already ready to go. You just pour on the granola and the coconut it comes with all that stuff in there and let it thaw. So you get six of them for 12 bucks. And these were the chicken sausages that Logan was eating that they're giving out today. They're these guys right here. They're by the brand Jones Dairy Farm and he loved them. He wants me to circle back around. That's what he keeps saying to me. Circle back around, mommy. I want more. As far as the frozen section goes, you guys, they have so many options here. Like this mandarin orange chicken would be perfect if you guys have like crazy nights with sports or anything like that. You get a four pound box for 14 bucks. You can also do this vegetable yakisoba right here. That would be perfect for after sports or something like that. It contains six packages in there. So you would just empty however many you need into your pan for your family. They've got fried rice. We also have some shrimp wonton and ramen soup. That would be good. Also these Don Miguel mini tacos. I've heard great things about them. We can't eat them because they're, you know, corn, which Derek can't eat. And then they have cheese, which I can't have. So um, $10 though, I've heard they're fabulous in the air fryer. I know I told you guys about this Mexican street corn before by the tattoo chef. Obviously it has some kind of dairy in it, but if you are not allergic to dairy, the, um, Tattoo Chef stuff is amazing for 10 bucks. They also have these bacon wrapped and cheese stuffed jalapenos. So if you're into that kind of stuff, right here for 10 bucks. Just saw this, I've never seen this before. This is Milo's Famous Sweet Tea. It comes in individual bottles, which could be helpful if you're on the go. For $6.99, you get 12 of them in there. I don't know if that's good. Has anybody tried the Milo's Sweet Tea? Let us know in the comments. 
these are also in the frozen section. These are everything crusted cod. They're gluten-free, which is amazing. They're by the brand Hook, Line, and Saber. Let's see, $13.49 for almost two pounds of it. I have no idea if that's good for fish or not. We don't eat fish since Derek is allergic to it. They also have this North Atlantic Ocean perch. So I don't know. If you guys are into fish, they have so many options here for fish. Like it goes all the way down this aisle, which is incredible. This one though, I remember eating with my mom. It's by Sea Cuisine or whatever. I don't know. Um, tortilla crusted tilapia though. It's fabulous. It's got like just a little hint of spice and some crunch on the outside. It's really good for 13 bucks. If you're looking for some things to go with sides or meals or whatever, they have organic rice cauliflower here, which is a fabulous in place of rice or just like a bulk like food to throw into a soup or something to kind of beef it up a little. $7.99 for that guy. You can also do some organic green peas or broccoli florets. And then everybody talks about them having like a vegetable blend um, to throw into their meals. And I would agree, they have tons of little vegetable blends to throw in, which is super easy to do, especially when it's frozen and you don't necessarily need to worry about it going bad. Um, but this one would be what I would be interested in. It's the Pura Vita fire roasted vegetable blend. It's Brussels sprouts, mushrooms, red onions, bell peppers, um, and then it's tossed with like some pepper and olive oil and salt. Honestly, if you've been to one Costco, you've been to an, two of them all, but they kind of divvy it up um, and put different products, just a few of them here and there. So if you are not used to a frozen section or you venture out to like a new Costco, you might find some new products. That's kind of the point of what I was trying to tell you guys with the frozen section. Like for instance, right now at my Costco, they do not have these organic sweet dark cherries that are in the frozen section and they are perfect for a berry freeze. They are so good and so sweet and so juicy. So I'm gonna grab two bags of those. They're $10 a piece. I'm also gonna grab some of these frozen blueberries right here. It's the organic frozen blueberries that I grab every time. Even when we're at home, they still have these guys. Um, thankfully, for some reason, they just taste better than any other frozen blueberry. I have tried others like from other places, Walmart, Kroger, whatever you wanna call it. And these are the best. So I always get a bag of these while we're here. We still have one in the freezer. Otherwise I'd be grabbing a couple. If you guys wanna know how to make the berry freeze, it's super easy. I have it in my highlights on my Instagram, but if you don't have Instagram, it's literally you just pour frozen berries in a bowl and top it with any milk of your choice. So I do almond milk, I'll do oat milk, um, macadamia nut milk, you could just do regular milk, and then you put toppings on it. So like I love to do granola or mini chocolate chips, some peanut butter, um, you can do, I don't know, what else have we put on it? Like fresh fruit, strawberries, bananas, super easy and it's really filling and nutritious. So anyways, okay, I've talked enough. We're gonna grab some blueberries here for $7.79. If you guys are kombucha fans, I love kombucha. This mango lime one sounds so good. It's by Kavita, $11.99. You get six of them, so basically $2 a bottle. That's cheaper than I saw it at Target the other day. At Target, they're about $2.99 a bottle, so a dollar cheaper. They also have these Stonyfield Organic Kids, um, basically go-gurts. You get 12 strawberry, 12 mixed berry in there for $8.99. I'm guessing that's a lot cheaper than the store too. We never really buy these ones, but maybe we should now that we're kind of introducing dairy back into Logan's diet. You can also grab these organic Danimal smoothies. Never seen Danimals have anything organic before, but you get 18 strawberry, strawberry banana and 18 strawberry, and they are on sale until September 26th. Can I even talk for $8.49? I have never seen them have a massive pack of Chobani flips here before, but if you eat dairy, these are so good. They're more of a treat than they really are healthy, but um, it comes with four key lime crumble, four cookies and cream, four strawberry cheesecake, and four s'mores. Uh, that sounds pretty dang good to grab on your way out the door in the morning. $12 for 16 of them. If you guys are into chai tea, I believe this is the mix that they use at Starbucks too. It's the Tazo chai tea. Um, they're now selling it in three packs. I don't know. I've never seen that before. Um, at least at Costco for $7.89, which is a great deal. So if you like chai tea in the winter time or fall time, this is definitely what you want. It's just the black tea blend and then you mix it with milk. I'm sure you guys have seen this mango nectar here if you've ever been to Costco, but, um, organic mango nectar, it's like a pretty big bottle of it right now it's two dollars off so i figured we're gonna go ahead and try it 3.99 he asked for it too he asked for some juice this week um so is that what a monkey does nice what does an elephant do you don't okay anyways i grabbed one of these guys it would be fabulous mixed with lemonade too and their lemonade here is so good you get two bottles for six bucks logan actually just climbed up here and i realized i have never looked close enough before at this to know that it's not actually milk 
This is almond. <laughs> They're individual organic chocolate banana almond milk things. They're vegan, dairy, and soy free. I wonder if they're, I'm sure they're gluten free. It's, it's freaking milk, but who knows? They add wheat into everything. I think we're going to try these. I think he'd like those. You know, I can't come to Costco without getting some of our marinara sauce. I'm going to grab two of these guys. You get four of them for 10.69. So, okay. You get two for 10.69, but I'm buying two of them. So I'm going to get four. <laughs> My child. Hello. Yeah. <laughs> We're gonna grab some ketchup. This is the only option they have here this time. Oh my gosh, it's a three pack. That's huge. Okay, three of them for six sixty nine. dollars You wanna help me put it in the cart? I am not doing very well with organization here. We need to, we need to help this out. Last thing on our list today is size three diapers, but I did put a few things in the cart that I didn't show you guys, so make sure you stay until we do the final cart here, but we love the Kirkland diapers. They did raise the price a little bit, um, but I think it's because they put what what is that 24 more diapers in there so we're gonna grab some of these the size three are for sis he's in a size five let's go ahead and do our final cart here before i throw that massive box of diapers in here we have some angie's boom chicka pop here for a fun little snack also grab some of these slim and hot cheetos they don't have these at our costco but they have them here for like six bucks so that's not too bad um we also grabbed some of these gluten-free chicken nuggets. Really excited to see how these do. They were in the frozen section. Two things of organic dark sweet cherries for my berry freeze. Some organic blueberries. We grabbed this organic fruit and veggie pouches by the Kirkland brand. We've grabbed these before. They're about $10. They didn't have the regular applesauce this time, or I would have grabbed that. Um, we also grabbed two things of bananas. Oh, thank you very much, sir. Oh, yep, it's almost your turn to get out, okay? Almost. You're going to help me scan. We grabbed some mango nectar right down here. There are some different things for us that we haven't gotten before. Um, two of the buffalo style dips. They're so dang good. Uh, some ketchup. We got some little creamer potatoes down there. Two things of the Rayo's sauce right here. We grabbed some broccoli florets, some cauliflower florets, and some Brussels sprouts. We grabbed two things of our almond flour tortillas. We're gonna make some Mexican lasagna this next coming week, which you guys know I love. Um, we're doing some ground beef right there. Right down here, you can kind of see some of our fruit. We grabbed some blackberries and some strawberries right underneath that, as well as some organic raspberries that ended up all the way down there. Don't know really how that happened. Probably not too good for those guys, but we also grabbed some of these stone fire non dippers. Those do contain wheat. We are starting to give him more wheat products. I still will be eating gluten-free at home, um, but since we're at grandma's and other people can eat them, he's trying some wheat products just to make sure he doesn't have an allergy anymore. He did when he was um, like an infant and even into early toddler years, but it seems like his belly is adjusting better. That's besides the point. We also got these cascade packs right down here. You can see that big old box of them. And I think that's about it. What do you think, buddy? Are you ready to go? Yeah, let's grab our diapers and go. Say bye. You wanna say bye? Bye. <laughs> Alrighty, we are back at the car. We're gonna get everything loaded in. We spent 280. That's not even that bad. You guys have seen. I've had some $500 Costco hauls. I tend to get a little crazy in there, but I think it's easier for me uh, to not buy everything when I know like we're going home. So anyways, all right, we're gonna head home now.